We are not human beings having a spiritual experience, rather, we are spiritual beings having a human experience, we are spending time here on earth to acquire a human experience. We go through both pleasant and unpleasant moments, it's no wonder we are born crying, as we already know the difficulties we will face in life, this is planet earth, not paradise. If you want to be happy 24 hours a day, 365 days a year, you're in the wrong place. Here, we have happy moments and not so happy moments, it's part of life. Some days we feel great, and other days we don't, but if you're not feeling well, it won't last long it will get better. Likewise, if everything is going very well, it won't last long either, and things may get worse. Life is like a cake that requires various ingredients, the first is the respect you have for yourself, your self-image and how much you love yourself, no one can give what they don't have. You cannot offer love to others if you don't love yourself, you cannot offer intelligence to others if you don't possess it for yourself, the first step to success is self-love. In the world, this is called self-esteem, and this self-esteem is not made of cement or steel, but of language, no one is doomed to be who they have always been. We are the only animals on planet Earth with the ability to transcend. To transcend means to start anew. It doesn't matter what happened in your childhood or the suffering you've endured until now. Your past was necessary for you to reach this moment, but the future is a possibility. If you don't become aware of this, your future will only be a repetition of the patterns of your past. Are there family patterns you would like to break free from? After all, your family, like everyone's, is not perfect. To be a doctor, one must study medicine, to be a lawyer, one must study law, but to be a parent, all you have to do is reproduce, parents learn from the mistakes of their children, and your parents made mistakes with you. Just as their parents made mistakes with them, your children will also make mistakes with your grandchildren, this process of learning from mistakes is part of life, there is no need to feel guilt. When parents have more children, they tend to make fewer mistakes with the second and even fewer with the third, and the second ingredient of life is communication. In the agricultural era, those who owned land held power, in the industrial era, those with capital dominated, but today, knowledge is the currency. However, knowledge only has value when it is applied and passed from one mind to another, this is done through dialogue, through communication, therefore, Communication has become essential for both personal and professional success. Evolution is part of the nature of the human spirit. No one asks for a blessing to worsen their life. We always want to grow and achieve our goals. You want to pass the college entrance exam, graduate, get a job, be promoted, open your own business. This is part of the human growth cycle. There are three levels of communication. The first is mouth to ear, the second is brain to brain, and the third is heart to heart.